Hello, my name is Martin and this is 3D Printing Iceland. In this video I'm going to do a review of a PLA from Record. So let's have a look after the intro. So at Earth I met up with Record or Alan that has a Record brand. Um, he was nice enough to hand this filament over to me. It was a box of uh, four color mini maker PLA set, record V line and two rolls of a, like a half a kilo spool. Um, he gave this to me without any cost to me on no money exchanged hands so this is just my review and um, he was curious to, to get my thoughts on it and here in the mini makers set there are four colors yellow, blue, green and, and red. So this is the, the mini set and then he handed over two rolls, like half a kilo rolls of red and blue. So thank you Alan for giving this to me. I was really excited to meet you and, and get this filament. Um, I printed out several things to test it out and Alan was curious to know my thoughts on it. So. I decided to do this review of the filament. So overall I had very good results. Uh, they say on the spool that you should print up 220C and that is what I used, 220C to print out uh, the samples and I got good results with that. So let's have a look at a close-up camera of, of my results. So usually my first print is like a stringing test and what I found out, I got a little bit of stringing in with using C-Hop and I disabled C-Hop in the remaining of the prints and that helped out a lot to disable C-Hop on my Prusa printers um, but otherwise the test print came out pretty good and the pieces are pretty strong, it's quite difficult to, to break it, to break, break it apart so the PLA is holding up pretty good. Um, this one I printed out after disabling C-Hop. You can still see a little bit of stringing, but uh, much less than before. Um, the same, it was giving me good results. Um, and then I printed out those brake tests. Um, one, in, one is printed out standing up like this, so I can test the strength of the layer adhesion and this one is printed on the bed like this so it will have more strength and what I usually do is just to break this and see how difficult it is. Um, I would say it's like medium difficult compared to other materials so it was holding up pretty good um, for this one that was laying down that was quite difficult so it has good strength to it. Uh, layer adhesion with this test was, was I would say medium and um, the strength on this was pretty good so I was quite happy with that and then printed out those overhang tests and one is facing the fan and one is facing away from the fan and both came out excellent there's absolutely no issues and even at 70 degrees uh, the prints are coming out excellent and absolutely no drooping issues whatsoever so it was giving me excellent results in overhangs so I was quite happy with that and it's quite quite, quite strong it's difficult to to break it so that was really good and then I printed this bridging test and it came out absolutely perfect there's a one strand here that is loose but this is one of the best bridging tests of this model I've done so I was really happy with the bridging capabilities of this filament and even printing at 220C that's quite hot for a BLA um, it was giving me excellent results so this was really good and then this test it tests various things and uh, here's a overhang test that came out excellent and the surface here on the underneath of the dome that's really smooth and no issues here and here's a bridging test also that came out excellent so all those synthetic tests were coming out excellent 
and I printed out this bridging test and this is a really long bridge and here you can see some stringing I had but uh, other than that it came out pretty good and here the overhang dome test is giving me excellent results and here it in the topmost part it is 80 degrees so at 80 degrees I had a little bit of drooping before it started to bridge the top but other than that it came out excellent and it was really good and the long bridges here were out without any issues so overall I had really good results and then printed out Mr. Belly and that also came out pretty good also there's a small amount of stringing so it was maybe the only issue I could find with this filament is, is stringing but overall the, the feet are really strong often I can break them very easily off but in this filament it's quite quite strong so this test came out excellent and my maker coin that came out also excellent without any issues very smooth and, and the letters here on the top came out really really clear so details were very good and the maker coin came out excellent and no no issues what I had there and the Omnum model that came out excellent and it was no issues with that one and the artist model that one came out excellent also so that's really good then the dual bot that also came out excellent no issues whatsoever um, so I was quite happy with this filament it was giving me excellent results and it looks awesome both the green and the red are coming out excellent um, I can see on the screen the color calibration on the on this camera is not any good for this model maybe on on this camera it shows up better the green green color is really dark green I have to adjust color balance on, on this camera I think and then I printed out four pencils with all the colors and they also came out excellent and no issues so I was really happy with this filament so overall I had great results with this filament from a record the PLA V value line and I had no issues printing it they stated that you should print at 220 degrees and that's the temperature I used I was using my Prusa MK2 and MK3 printers to do those tests and had great results and no, no issues. The, the only maybe one complaint I could take note of is stringing and I had, had some stringing issues but other than that it was giving me very good results and then PLA was uh, really nice colors. The yellow is like light yellow color and also the blue is rather light blue but the green and the red are like deep green and, and green deep red and I love the green and the red colors and it's a, it's a very good good color and for the yellow it is a lighter color than the Fun King yellow <laughs> that's a benchmark for the yellows it's a Fun King yellow but this is a quite quite lighter yellow than that one but other than that the colors are great but I favor the green and the yellow and the and the red but for this video this will be it I hope you like this video on my thoughts on the record PLA and like I stated in the beginning Alan gave this filament to me to test it out and, and he wanted to know my thoughts on it so no money exchanged hunt and, and it's just my thoughts on the filament so for now I thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one